Hey everyone, Edgy Berserker here with Soul Calibur 4. So I got some good news, got some bad news. <laughs> good news is, uh, we finished off of Cervantes. Now we're at Al Gol. And I understand I have people way up at the top there. It's fine, I'll get to them. <laughs> so that's the good news. The bad news is, Edgy's catching a cold. So, I... <laughs> As long as things go well, I hope I have my voice still. <laughs> Anyways, after what seems to be an eternity, the hero king Al Gol had reawakened amidst the violent torrent released when the two swords came into contact with each other, managed to steal part of their power. Al Gol then began to look for a way to manifest himself in a, the tangible world, and after some trial and error, came upon just the means to do it. Without warning, an enormous tower appeared in the Ostrensburg. The Tower of Glory has risen out of Alcol's memory and, through his tremendous power, been reconstructed as the Tower of Remembrance. Within its walls he could reign just as he had long ago. There he could take physical form, but his return was not perfect. His new body was constructed of thoughts and retaining his form consumed much of the power he had stolen. If it ran out, the tower, and the hero king himself, would vanish like a mirage. Al Gol needed more power. Very soon, the spirit sword and the curse sword would face off again. He must claim them both. He felt it in his bones. He knew his overwhelming desire would resonate fiercely with the two blades and beckon their wielders towards the capital. Come to me, show me your power. With unshakable resolve, Al Gol materialized two blades, fashioned after the spirit sword and the cursed sword. With their power at his command, and a fierce longing to fight, he waited in the Tower of Remembrance for strong warriors who had inevitably arrived. All right, the gathering. Yeah, I'm catching a cold. Um. Recording this on Canadian Thanksgiving, so the day before this gets posted up. And, Only you know, my dad has a cold, sister has a cold, a lot of the waitresses that work for my parents' restaurant had colds. I was surrounded by all the colds. Even at work, guess what? Fucking colds everywhere. Well, I guess finally it's come to Edgy, who has no time to get sick. <laughs> Especially not this week. I got shit to do, man. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm having the time of my life right now. <laughs> Whoa, hello, Rock. How are you? I gotta punch you in the butt. That's fine. I have a cannon fist. That's kind of amazing. Good night. I cannot ignore your evil deeds. I can ignore mine, but thanks for asking. Oh, and I'm super excited. If you haven't seen on my Twitter, I achieved a uh, a copy of Bloody Roar Primal Fury for the uh, GameCube. So I made the decision because the uh, Xbox version, you can't play with that on original Xbox. And also, it's disgustingly expensive. But the GameCube version has one of the aesthetics that I prefer anyways. So, I mean... Really and truly. Uh, if you look up uh, Matt McMuscles' video on the Bloody Roar Introspective, I highly recommend it. It's really good. Um, and Every it gave me the information I needed to, to know. Like for the fact sword. when I get to Bloody Roar 4, I need to run it on emulator to do save states. <laughs> Especially with the bullshit of the final boss that they have. Oi, 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 that's bullshit. So yeah, um, I, I mean, I haven't even gotten to Bloody Roar 3 yet. And knowing that Primal Fury is not just like a rehash of 3, um, uh, you know what? I, that one will be covered in full as well after 3 sort of thing. Of course, and I haven't even decided to touch a Bloody Roar yet in a bit. Only because I have some ideas of other games that I want to check out. No, don't play with me. I'm the evil guy. Stop it. Ow. <laughs> but I'm the hero. Where am I? I have a Mega Man arm. That makes me kind of cool. On a side note, though, I'm super excited to also be starring Man of Medan. It's funny, any eagle-eyed viewer would notice that. Oh, wait, this playlist showed up. <laughs> I wonder if that's a new Sunday thing. <laughs> hey, 
And also, if an eagle-eyed viewer saw on Patreon, I would also update my list to have it as well. It always seems that uh, my finales tend to appear all at the same time. Oh, this fellow always tries sulfing. Oh, it's cute. <laughs> Woo! That is a crotch thrust of death. Let's see that again. I wonder if I can do it. Crotch that? No, it's just the back breaking of doom. <laughs> God, what's... Oh, hi. Sir. There we go. Ooh, that was a Mega Man cannon to do. That's kind of cool. Oh, that was fucking just rad. Shit, damn. I got a new honor. Shit. I'm getting shit. This is good. Wish I still had my save game of this, though. Of course, I also know that this was like a game that was before the trophy system. That's why you don't see trophies popping up for SoCal for 4, funny enough. No, you're doing a good job, BB. Good job. <laughs> oh, God. My throat's doing the thing. I mean, uh, if I do lose my voice, that means um, heavy reading stuff like... Um, po uh, not Pokemon. Jesus, Digimon. Um, might be put on hold, but I'm gonna be recording some Digimon later after I record some Soul Calibur. So, as long as my voice doesn't crack out in the middle of it, I should be okay. Anytime after, it'll be kind of hilarious. <laughs> but I don't understand why you have those weird eyes. What the hell? Seriously, that character's design really clashes with the game. And we're talking about a game that has, like, uh, Darth Vader and Yoda in it. <laughs> God damn. Determination. Obsession. Hope. It is only natural for time. time no longer holds any stage Isn't it start. interesting, though, how it's basically, like, just Al Gold doing this thing on his tower. Not even, like, him climbing it. It's just him waiting for the fighters. That's actually pretty awesome. I like that. Enjoy your back, Rika. Just back away from that shit. Father, is that you? Um, I don't know you or you are. I don't know you are, boy. Oh, that is son. Our Curtis. Oh, are we getting story shit? Oh, I like that we're getting story shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. This might be his son. Well, son, I think you need to go to your room. It's a good boy. Victory will be mine in the end. Oh my God! Also, um, when I post this up, the Sara's coming up, up and out, and yeah, I will be streaming also um, today as well. So I'm gonna mention that since this is a Tuesday episode. But yeah, I'll be streaming today, uh, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I've decided that I'm gonna do um, Samurai Showdown today because Basara is gonna be out. And on the Thursday episode, I have more time to play um, um, Uncharted. So yeah, so yeah, Samurai Showdown is gonna be on for uh, streaming. So twitch.tv slash edgyberserker. Hang out there, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, maybe a little earlier, not sure. Around that time, though. Check my Twitter for updates. Ooh, what's going on here? Oh, I gotta fight Siegfried. Okay. Eh, we already seen those. <laughs> the last key. <laughs> but yeah, though. Um, yeah, come join for the stream. It's always fun. Seem to, I might actually do a super cut of just all the dumb memes that happen during live streams. This is a sort of absolute like Kukri's magic tippies. pouch. <laughs> Stage start. <laughs> oh God, I gotta play that game again, <laughs> eventually. I fucking love SNK heroines. I don't care what anyone says. That was my game of the year for 2018. <laughs> or 19. God, everything's blending, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it was 18 because I had the fatal cutie hat for Halloween. I remember, okay. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, that was my 2018 game for sure. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, come join me for some Samurai Showdown. I'll probably be doing running some practice mode with Basara. And then I might also do some versus. Maybe some arcade mode as well, just to, you know, get the gist of my boy. But first, though, we need to see why this man is gyrating towards us. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> Let's watch. This timeless place. I shall become whole once again. Desired is now within my hands. This body, this power. Everything. But. I must not look back. A true sovereign does not have that luxury. What the resurrected Algol aims to achieve is an eternal rule that will never die. Meow, meow, meow. So he's evil dictator man, I guess? I don't know. Anyways, though, <laughs> this is Edgy Berserker signing off on this edition of Soul Calibur 4. <laughs> so until the next episode, um, we'll see what we earned first before I do that, actually. Oh, don't even know. Anyways, till the next episode, I'll see y'all later uh, again. 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time of October 15th, 19, not 19, 2019, my god. <laughs> Come join me for some um, Samurai Showdown, Basara, get back with my boy. So yeah, see y'all later, bye now.